Ujenzi wa kituo kipya cha mapokezi ya wageni katika uwanja wa ndege wa kimataifa wa Jomo Kenyatta unatarajiwa kuanza miezi sita ijayo. Waziri wa Uchukuzi Kipchumba Murkomen amesema serikali imeingia kwenye hatua za mwisho za kutangaza zabuni ya ujenzi wa kituo hicho kupitia ushirikiano wa sekta za umma na kibinafsi na kitawezesha uwanja wa JKIA kupokea zaidi ya wasafiri milioni 20 kila mwaka. Kituo hicho Kipya kitakuwa na angatua vitengo hamsini vya ukaguzi, vituo vinane vya kuingia katika uwanja wa ndege na maegesho 45 ya ndege. For construction of a new terminal, uh, hopefully through PPP, and we should complete the process in less than six months. Our plan is to ensure that uh, Jomo Kenyatta International Airport will have a brand new terminal, and then uh, the PPP arrangement will ensure that this old terminal next uh, will have a link to the new terminal, which will be actually sitting around this area. So we have people who move from Kenya to Somalia on a weekly basis. We have diplomatic community that is based in Nairobi that also cover Somalia and go to Mogadishu very often. The UN family is huge in Somalia and those countries in the Horn of Africa. Because uh, we are restarting this uh, route after six years of, of RAL. We last to Mogadishu in uh, 20, 2018. So today we are relaunching this flight back to Mogadishu. Mogadishu is very critical for us. I'm extending to my heart congratulations, heartfelt congratulations to Kenyan Airways and the Kenyan government for their unwavering commitment to bringing the pride of Africa to the pride people of Somalia. Count of three, two, one, start